they all snuggle but up together. <laughs> but it's cozy sleeping. But tonight you may need to be yeah, snuggled up. Tonight's a little chilly. Definitely snuggle up with the dogs or the cats or right. the spouses, whoever. But you know what? At least it's not as bad here as it is across the northern plains, where, yes, there are inches of snow on the ground. It may be April 10th, but take a look at what people in the upper Midwest are dealing with. This video is from Rapid City, South Dakota. Oh, we do not miss these days. Blizzard warnings are in effect. They've been issued all day long across the central part of the country. In some parts, this storm could be historic. It's not very often that we see this much snow this late in the season, April 10th, and many spots getting blanketed by snow from the Dakotas down into Nebraska and also up into portions of Minnesota and Wisconsin this afternoon and tonight. Locally, it doesn't make our temperatures seem all that bad. It's 51 degrees in Philadelphia. We're talking about a chilly night, but hey, at least we don't have six inches of snow on the ground. It's 45 in Allentown, 46 in Redding, and 46 degrees in Trenton. It's quiet for now, but the breeze is still with us. Winds about 10 to 15 miles an hour, depending on where you are. 16 mile an hour winds in the city, 10 miles per hour in Allentown, 13 miles per hour there in Wilmington. But let's take a look at that storm that's really causing problems across portions of the Midwest. You can see the warm front starting to drape into western Pennsylvania and Ohio right now, but the main push of the storm you can see that comma shape the center of the low back here. Look at that circulation and in Nebraska right now we've got half the state under a blizzard warning. The other half of the state under severe thunderstorm watches and warnings completely different snow on the back edge, some strong storms on the front edge. Nebraska getting the brunt of it right now. Blizzard warnings and winter storm warnings in effect all across South Dakota and that extends into Minnesota as well. But this is lifting to the north and by the time it gets here, we're going to get kind of the tail end, the cold front that extends down from the center of the low, bringing us some showers and thunderstorms late Friday night, but no snow in our forecast. Overnight, partly cloudy and chilly with a low around 40. Tomorrow is a quiet day with a mix of sun and clouds. More clouds in the morning, more sun in the afternoon. Nice day, though, 59 degrees the daytime high. So a light jacket is necessary. Low 40s in the morning. No better than the 50s in the afternoon, but still a pretty pleasant April day. Friday and Saturday warm up back to the low 70s, so just the T-shirt needed for those two days. But the warm up comes as that system approaches. So as that big strong storm moves eastward, it's going to generate a southwest wind starting actually late tomorrow and continuing into the day Friday. That's going to help us warm up. Friday we will see breaks of sun. Most of the daylight hours are dry, but then here comes that front. It'll slide through Friday night and into early Saturday morning with the chance for a line of showers and thunderstorms to wake you up early on Saturday. It's also going to start to turn windy out ahead of that front. Winds could gust to 35 miles an hour Friday, 25 miles an hour on Saturday, and then Sunday the winds pick up once again. So we're going to trade this kind of slightly cooler, sunny weather for warmer weather, but also turning a little bit unsettled with windy conditions through the weekend. Friday night and Saturday morning, a chance for showers and storms. Another chance for showers late Sunday. And you see that again on Monday. Showers and storms in the forecast before we clear it out by Tuesday of next week. So again, it's a trade off. I think I would take 60 and sunny over 70 and wet. I agree with you. For the most part. Yeah. Jeans and a sweatshirt. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Sneakers. Yeah, we've got to think about that one.